Hi, this is Jason with Dave's Computer Tips with another how-to video for you. This one's on how to manage backup payment methods on Amazon. That's right, your default credit card or card you have on file can have backup methods just in case that card fails on the transaction. So I'm going to show you how to do that on this video. But before we get going, please hit the like on the video. It really helps out our channel. Also hit the subscribe and the notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos we come out with every week. All right, let's get started. Okay, you want to go to your Amazon account. So I'm going to go to Amazon right over here. Boom, I'm on my Amazon account. If you haven't logged into your account, make sure you sign into your account. Then once you're signed in, go to the top right and go, hello, your name will be here or whatever name you have put on your account. You can either click on hello right here. You can click right here or you can go right under your account and click on account. Either one will get you to it. You can click on account in this video. And also, we are doing this on the website, amazon.com. We are not doing this on the mobile device in this video. We will do another video for that. So, but we're doing this on the website itself, amazon.com. So first we're going to click on account. And once you go into account, you're going to get this account screen and it gives you a whole bunch of stuff, but we were looking for your payments. And that's right here on the right side of mine. It might be in a different place on yours. So click on that, your payments. And then it brings up mine's under wallet because it's the last place I was at, but you have up at the top. If you look, it says Amazon pay. It says, overview wallet transactions settings we want settings so we're going to click on settings at the top here then once you're under settings this is your main settings for your account and we're going to go down we're going to skip over all this top stuff and then we're going to go down to this guy which says manage backup payment method that's what the one we want for this video so we're going to click on that and now here is where you can manage those backup methods so you can have whatever cards you have attached to your account will appear here and then you can choose which ones work um, if you look at the top it says if there is a problem with your payment we will automatically charge the backup payments and payment methods you select below for eligible products and services so what we're going to do is down here you can see i have a couple cards i click the ones to back up so if this one doesn't work this one kicks in if this doesn't work this one kicks in so i did that on mine you can do that on yours if you don't like having the backup payment method i can't even talk payment methods you click you can disable it right here or re-enable it so if you can click on that if you don't want to have it running but i think it's very important to have a backup because sometimes it's a pain so I have mine checked, so you can uncheck ones you don't want to have on. So uncheck that one, check that one. So these are backup payment methods. You can turn off ones you don't want to have being backup payment methods. So and that's pretty easy. Once you do that, you just go down to save. So I'm going to do it with, uh, let's see here. So select payment method, your credit card. Okay, so I'm going to unselect this one. And I'm going to hit save. And this is what it does. It spins and it tells you, it goes back to this screen. So you can go back to that screen again and now you can see it's been unchecked from the box so it's no longer part of the the selected backup payment methods that's it that's how easy it is to manage backup payment methods on amazon so make sure you get in there make sure you have some backups set up and that's it thanks for watching guys make sure to check out davescomputertips.com uh, where all, all our articles are and make sure to subscribe to this channel and thanks for watching.